I always knew I was a performer when I was a young kid, and, and um, I did a lot of theater growing up and started out I'm from Atlanta, and I started out working at Six Flags and doing theme parks. Then I just made my way to New York and said, I've got to do it. And, um, and it was a great experience. I loved performing. I did the musical Grease in Europe for two years and um, performed on a lot of cruise ships. I got to travel around the world. I think I did shows in like five different countries. It's just a great life, I love it. Then I ended up in Los Angeles and found out very quickly that singers, because I'm a singer, it's not really the most lucrative place to work. So I just kind of spent a lot of time figuring out what I wanted to do. I've done a lot of producing. I was one of the producers of Groovaloo in New York, producing and producing, th making great theater, cr just creating lots of stuff. About four years ago, I realized I wanted to start my own business and shooting headshots was something that I figured I could do because I have a great eye for it and that's kind of how I got started. What led me to start shooting headshots specifically was a growing desire to see other people succeed and to have be able to have the experience that the experiences that I had in my life. There's so many people out there that don't know what they're doing or take advantage of people. And there's so many kids that come into town and they spend a year or two spinning their wheels because they don't have their footing right. And, and so I just figured if I could learn how to do great headshots and, um, and find a niche, which I did finding in the shooting dancers, then I would be able to hopefully get them right off the ground when they get here with good pictures, which is one foot that they really have to have when they first get here. What every young dancer needs to know right when they get into town is that it's gonna be very difficult to work unless you don't, unless you have an agent, number one. Number two, it's all about networking with choreographers and other dancers. And number three, you need great pictures. The reason that people need great pictures is because when the pictures are laid out on a casting table, or if someone, or if a casting director or a choreographer is looking at photographs, if you have a picture that's subpar or not as good as the photo that's next to you, then you're out the door immediately. You can dance better than every person in LA and, and potentially quite never work just because you're not represented appropriately. My philosophy on shooting headshots is that, again, we need to have the subject, the person, the talent, completely pop off the page. The reason I shoot white background is because, it was for a couple of reasons. The first reason really is because uh, everybody kept saying, I kept hearing people for years say, don't shoot on a white background because it's old school and it looks cheesy. And um, I figured out a way to kind of make it not look cheesy and make it super cool and hip. And that's by combining, for, and I do it really for dancers the most because we combine all of your looks on a white background, the only color that's actually popping off your picture is you. I do love um, colored backgrounds and I still shoot colored backgrounds. It just it kind of depends on the feel of the shoot or the what we're trying to capture in the person. But uh, for the most part, I find that the white background, for me, for dancers, is, is actually helping a lot of people get work. The colored backgrounds are great, but it's something else to look at on the page. And a lot of times people go, oh, I love that blue background. Well, I don't want them to say I love that blue background. I want them to say, oh, look at your picture. Ben Allen, you look amazing. Shooting with me is a special experience because you're not just walking in and getting photos done. This isn't Olin Mills, and I'm not a, a cheap $150 headshot photographer. I specialize in what I do and I take care of the clients and my goal is to ease the concerns of the clients and to have them feel so comfortable with the entire process from the moment they call to book until the moment they get their Z cards. They're, they have no concern whatsoever that they're going to get great photos.